Thank you, Ben Stiller, for reminding me how old I am. Thank you, Ben. Directed by Noah Baumbach, starring Ben Stiller, Naomi Watts, Adam Driver, Amanda Siegfried, and Charles Grodin. This movie is about a couple in their 40s, Ben Stiller and Naomi Watts, Josh and Cornelia. And they've been trying to have a child, but they've been very unsuccessful. They meet up with a couple in their 20s, Adam Driver, Amanda Siegfried, Jamie and Darby. Jamie and Josh have something in common, they are both in the field of making documentaries. Josh has had success in that field while Jamie is trying to break into that field and Jamie wants to learn stuff from Josh. At the same time, Josh is learning stuff from Jamie. Then you have Charles Grodin in the movie who is Josh's father-in-law. He's very good in the movie. and This movie is very good. I did like this. This movie is about how the young and the old look at the world and how we do things now versus how we did things back then because you have Ben Stiller and Naomi Watts watching stuff on Netflix but you have Adam Driver and Amanda Siegfried watching stuff on VHS you have Ben Stiller and Naomi Watts listening to stuff on CDs but Adam Driver and Amanda Siegfried like to listen to stuff on vinyl, but <laughs> that was pretty cool nostalgia. And it's pretty funny trying to see Naomi Watts doing hip hop with Amanda Siegfried. <laughs> that was very funny. Or seeing Ben Stiller ride around on rollerblades. Seeing how Charles Grodin looks at the world as well since he's like in his 80s, which is pretty cool. And this was just a very good movie. I did like this movie. The movie is just so good at showing different perspectives, like how we used to remember stuff by just remembering stuff from our brains versus how we do it now by just looking up on Google, which <laughs> shows how dependent we are on our technology. And that was just so cool. The, the flaw of this movie, though, is the fact that there's really not much new within Ben Stiller that we haven't really seen before. This is pretty much the same character he has played in Meet the Parents and Night at the Museum, but at the same time this movie knows how to use that kind of character to its full potential and I did like that. I like the chemistry that everybody has in the movie. That is done very well, as well as the contrast between young and old. And it was just a very good movie. I'll give this movie a B plus. Definitely check this movie out.